the yak. We're here. <laughs> we're gonna make it real hard to shoot today. The yak. We're in this bitch. Um, presented by Roback. We love Roback here. Kyle loves it. Adam loves it. Tommy loves it. I loves it. And I love it the most, probably. Uh, fresh off a of restock, the most comfortable performance joggers on the planet. If you're not going to uh, want to miss out, they're functional, versatile, comfortable. They check off every single box. Tommy, you want to throw in ad-libs? Uh, Roback's subtle dog logo on two-striped ridge keeps popping up everywhere we go. Everywhere. I was just in Minneapolis. I saw it. Good ad-lib. Uh, we always make sure to give a little nod when we see somebody rocking the Roback. That's what I did. You nodded? I nodded. You nod up or down? D uh, down. I think up feels like more of a tick. I used to have a tick where I couldn't stop nodding my head. Anyways, <laughs> use code YAK, Y-A-K, at Roback.com for 20% off your first purchase through the end of this week. That's spelled R-H-O-B-A-C-K.com. 20% off all performance hoodies, joggers, and polos with code YAK. Get ready for the spring with Roback. Or the summer, even. Or the summer. Tommy, you've been a road dog. Road dog. You've been Chicago to Key West to Minneapolis. Your little pecker's going Hamptons. to fall off. Yeah, and you're kind of... Hamptons. A, Nashville see, coming up this Nashville weekend. Nashville coming up. Yeah, it's been fun, you know? Uh, it was uh, just a world tour, sort of spread my spread my brand to different brands. The Key dozen. West, you were fishing. Key West, deep sea fishing, caught some Goliath groupers, caught some nurse sharks. I'd like to announce that Tommy Smokes is now a made man at Barstool. You could tell by that amount of travel. Yep. What does that mean? You're made. You're, you're made. made man. No, you're like... You were always kind of worried about getting let go. So I, you're saying I can't now? Not yeah. Anymore. You can't get your made. Wow. Yeah. You're a made man at Barstool Sports. Come on, throw on a rap song. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you're the most roller coaster guy ever. You go through two week periods where everyone is stroking you almighty. Then you right. get bullied yeah. almighty. Yep. Right. Back, yep. It's, it's just almighty it's a fun life. To your totter. It takes a thick skin. It takes a thick skin that takes years to develop. How do you um, how do you manage your anger? Small animals. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Strangle them. Do you feel like this is a Tommy Renaissance happening right now? No, not necessarily. I feel like twenty twenty two was was a, was a big year for me. Twenty twenty two was huge, but uh, the you're on I Tommy's on ice right now. I think that's how I'd I'd like to put Tommy. He's What's like. That mean? You're on ice, like you're in an in-between period. You're in the yeah. chrysalis right now. Yeah, I don't think, you know, I have had, had a real strong 2022. First half of 2023 has been fine, but uh, I'm excited for the second half. second half is going to unleash him. It's yeah. going to be like the slingshot maneuver from Talladega Nights. The, the smoke show is going to be just, it's going to be so good. And then New York Tommy, when Tommy takes over the New York office, right. that's going to be elite. And then we're kind of looking at a period of when Tommy's going to need to pick, like, people that he's going to start anointing and, like, people that he's going to start putting under his big maid wing. Yeah, that, that's sort of what my 2024 is going to look like. Who, do you, who are you seeing? I mean, I, I put some stickers on people. I go around, I put stickers on people, and I just say, oh, you're mine now. Who have you done? I did that Who to you Dave yesterday in the Hampton. <laughs> you, you claim Dave? Yeah, I said Dave. I, I like your potential. At your partner in crime? Yeah, he's uh. So it's like it was a high noon commercial, and it's like if I'm doing a shoot, I'm I'm putting Big Bro in. He's like the Rob Schneider to, to my Adam Sandler sort of. So yeah. I said, I'm only doing this shoot if Dave gets a role too, and he had the the main role, and I was in the background. So everybody has duos here. They'd naturally find a partner. Mm -hmm. right. I want myself, Roan and Caleb, Roan and Sass. Uh, I mean, Dave. I mean Dave. Right. Mm -hmm. Did you get do, like a tryout for him? When did you know he had it? I feel like, I mean, I think we, we always sort of had a, a good dynamic. Um, but uh, I think it was the, the time we've spent apart recently where he's been, you know, in Miami, Montauk, where it's like distance makes the heart. Right. Thing. He's had no rag to mop up his cum. Right. Did I, you get pussy in Key West? Yes, no, he did. Yes, no. he did. Yes, he did. No, I but I don't want to answer this for every. He never city. tells. He, he never tells. Don't want to answer <laughs> for every city. L let us all just get one question you have to answer. No, 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 no. Don't. What was her name in Minneapolis? It. <laughs> it was. <laughs> I knew it, yeah, dude. You were made for Minneapolis. Yes, uh, yes. Look, yes, I, I'm yes. I, I'm not one to kiss and tell. I'm not one to kiss and tell. What did you? Yeah, you are. I, you were on. Well, let me. Well, what did you do in Minneapolis? I was on the Chicks in the Office live show with their special guest. What was the crowd like? Diversity, uh, male to female ratio? It was uh, an unbelievable amount of women. I would say 98% women. Really? So you could pick and choose? Yeah. 
I mean, that's not how I don't look at women. You treated that like a golden did you corral. Do any, <laughs> were you highlighted in any segments or just part of the audience? Uh, no, I, I came out on stage and I guess we did like a dating show for me or whatever. I was blindfolded with. Three we're women. blindfolded. That's your. <laughs> that's how you pick out your women. <laughs> I know. <It> was, <laughs> they should have just put lost my greatest asset. Yeah. And they asked questions and I awarded points to the best answers and whatnot. And so did you? For, so the who won the dating show? It's just one of the three. But weren't you part of the competition? No, they were. It was like if I was the bachelor and they were the, the truck. Tri- what kind of questions did you ask? I didn't write. Uh, it was. Uh, it was like you know, call or fi- nothing crazy. Like call or FaceTime. Is, um, sex on the first date. Is the former is Sean who used to work here on the, one of the shows? Yes, Sean. A uh, hot Sean. Saw, is it, yeah. Sort of intern. Is, is it at start? <laughs> He's on the Bachelor. At, he, it starts on. It's one of the guys. Yeah. They call him Hot Sean. I've never seen him. Oh, hot. he is hot. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It starts Monday, and well, I guess no spoilers, but I'm going to be watching every episode that he's in. I guess I'm going to have to watch every episode that he's in too. But uh, knowing him as an intern, having known him as an intern, makes him makes me. Well, I don't know. Like I look at the guys on the Bachelor, I'm like, these guys are hot. But having known this dude as an intern, I don't think I can look at him as a hot, as right. a hot dude. What is oh. his bio like? Oh, there's better pictures of him. Sean. Or That's Sean. his cast pick. Sean is really someone special. Okay. With gorgeous blue eyes, a great career, and an adorable French bulldog. This guy has it all. Should I be reading this? Or? Is that, yeah, yeah, is read that it, it all? Is that having it all? <laughs> What's his fun fact? Are there any fun facts? I'm just looking for the girl of my dreams to share my life with. He's here to find the perfect match. Pop. Who's Charity? Is that the read it all? Read it all. Read it all. Okay. A charity uh, has to be the Bachelorette. Who are they uh, competing for? The only thing Sean is missing from his life is a wife, and says, "I'm just looking for the girl of my dreams." Uh, the software salesman has worked hard in his career and even just bought his very first house. Jesus, he must be doing well. Sean is excited about the possibility of bringing Charity home and starting their lives together. When he isn't working, Sean loves golfing and boat rides with his friend. Sean is here to find his perfect match and to hopefully return home with Charity by his side. He bought a house. Sean in is self admittedly a terrible texter. Uh, Okay, people who, say, people who say pull that? Up, there's no such the, thing. There's no such always thing. Has their phone. Everybody has their phone. So I'm choosing not to text. Nick, I follow him on Instagram. He's at a Dodgers game with Michael Grove from Wheeling. Oh, from our hometown. How does he know him? And I think he's in the third slide. He's with the Bachelor girl. Oh, is that a spoiler? Okay. I'm the yeah, girl, girl who's on, like, Wait, well, who is the Michael Bachelor. Michael Grove's right? jersey. Yeah, that's a Wheeling boy. Shout out to Michael Grove, a pitcher for the Dodgers from Wheeling Park High School. And he's wearing his jersey. Uh, and he's is with, that her? Uh, I don't I don't think, think so. so. Oh. What? That didn't look anything like her. <laughs> I didn't see her yet. I just assumed it was her. Just cause, just based on the name? What is, what is her name? Charity. You said that woman looks like she'd be named Charity? or. It. I think it's her. It's, it said Isabella or something. Oh. Well. Yeah, he wouldn't do that. World's colliding. I mean, he better be best friends with this woman. Yeah, that's not her. I just got a picture. Yeah, but still, that's. I mean, the fact if he's out dating some other broad. Right. That's a spoiler in and of itself. Right. And that's what I. Well, they could just be friends at a game. That's what I'm saying. He, they better be besties. Right. Mm Hmm. They better be besties. I thought they're not like this. I'm pissed. Or it's Charity's friend, and so he does end up with her. There's a million ways it could go. Where did he buy a house, do you think? Pretty sure he lives in Tampa. Oh. I follow him on Instagram, too. Uh, did you like this post, Tommy? <laughs> no. Does he look like a girl to you? <laughs> <laughs> He's stunning. Yeah, good-looking guy. How did you get anything done in the office with him around? Dave wrote a blog saying, like, we're not allowed to have interns this hot. I need guys like like Tommy around. <laughs> uh, did, he, did he use you, uh, your name? Use me as a, specifically as an example of someone that was not hot enough to be distracting. What's annoying is you would go very, very far on The Bachelor, but they would never even cast you. Bachelorette, you mean? The Bachelorette, yeah. Yeah, you would. I don't know. I think Maybe. you would. If I could get through the first couple couple rounds i think we all would let's not be so hard on yourselves well you're married but Mar- i'm a married man I, w- yeah. I don't think i i don't i don't think i would no nikki would you would nikki you turn on that nikki charm forget about it i guess my charm's crazy <laughs> your charm game goes crazy and if kyle had like a really cool van like entry out of the out of the limousine with like and he was like 
in a speedo or something like that, like party boy, like Pawnee's or something like that. That's something that showed off your fucking rocking bod. I think you took the most handsome picture you've ever taken yesterday. Shirts. Yeah, it was one of my best. It looks really good. With, sh- with a shirt on. Oh, oh, with shirts. Oh, yeah. What the yeah. fuck? How was that? Huh. What it the was, fuck? It was, hey, it was great. It was fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, good environment. You know, no booze. He was Having sober fun. for us. We were supportive. Of, uh, he was supportive of us, us of him. So what were you guys getting fucked up off if, if there was no booze? The, we were all sober. Yeah, we were all sober. Um, he liked golf a lot, so I put I gave uh, one of my buddies is a big golf guy. Damn, Kyle, you, you look good as hell. So that's the picture? Yeah. You yeah, look like Kyle. Look how good Kyle looks there. Look at his eyes. Really good picture. Model eyes. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I kept no, He was, I mean, we got... I, w- I wish he was a little bit more crazy, but he he, he uh he threatened that, to sue a few times. Really? Yeah. So like if you us. do this, I'll sue. No, he kept on forgetting to duck when he got into the golf cart, <laughs> and he was smacking himself. So he was gonna yeah. sue the golf cart. Yes. Yeah. Oh, okay. Golf cart shouldn't have roofs. No, well, well, I for think the for the balls. balls yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, this is. You would think that Coleman was Dave Portnoy <laughs> the Coleman, way this yeah, TikTok got went. A lot of, so there's the f- there's the start. There's Coleman, and Diego. Diego. Back to him. There's Coleman. Yeah. <laughs> he's a bit. He's wait, a wait. What's so what? What video is this? That's hit on his. This TikTok. is behind the scenes. No, but I'm saying who's holding it because I see. His, is he? Uh, some he he will just hand you his phone and say to film. So probably Diego. Oh, Diego. Oh, that's Quinn. Yeah, he's a businessman. There we are. He was like if any influencer wasn't fake. There's Coleman. Yeah, we'd have gone a few frames. He kept saying, let's take a about. picture, a It selfie. was always a video. Yeah. Do the video. Who was that guy? The one with the tank top on. That's uh, Michael Quinn. You gotta know by uh, now. And he signed our captain's hats. Uh, Marty refused to take off his hat to be signed, so he just had to bend down. <laughs> 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 he almost did. He pained him, but he did. <laughs> no, but Marty, some, Marty knows, like, everybody. And he yeah, knew, he had Michael Quinn on Walk the Line years ago, and he reached out, so it was... Shout out to him for making that happen. So it was a dream come true for me. Expectations met, exceeded. I'm excited. I'm curious to see how we put together the video. It was we did three holes. We did three holes in three yeah, hours. We probably get a lot of that. <laughs> probably ten to fifteen minutes out of it. But I wanted to do four holes because that that's how many holes are in a t-shirt. Um, so we could yeah. just that's a like we do a, ra- a t-shirt round. Right. Uh, something they call it. It's like a golf term. And he he didn't want to do any more. We're like, you want to do one more? He's like, nah. Yeah. Well, see, I feel like I know the answer to this. Was he a good golfer? I mean, when he did hit it, he, I don't want to spoil He hit it pretty decently well. Like when we were driving. What we were doing. Yeah, 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 yeah. He was itching to get to Ru- Rudy's bar in Hell's Talking about Rudy's yeah. a lot. <laughs> he, did stay, he, sta- he stayed sober all day, um, but he was ready to go. They went to gym. They went to gym. Oh. Uh, Quinn him, and, him, and the, him and the guy. Yeah. God damn. They were live. The they are live every second of their day. Yeah, I didn't like that. Yeah, cuz yeah. Does he like make money off this stuff? His cameo, he made $8,000 last weekend, $7,000. Oh, last yeah. That's also He's why they're live so often. That's where they make money. Uh, you go live, you make money. Yeah. He's the perfect cameo character. Yeah. Yeah, he cashed in immediately. Yeah. There's one student. kid on cameo that Keeps on wanting to fuck Kyle. He's, well, he's he's trying so hard, and I hate that he thinks he can pull. What do you mean on cameo? There's a guy. There's a guy who's what's his name? Evan Sweeney. Evan Sweeney. He's he asking like he's acting like I'm not gonna fuck him because I haven't seen his requests to fuck me. I'm not. I just don't want to fuck you, dude. <laughs> um, but I respect him as a content creator. <laughs> well, but I don't understand what like he's posted. So someone he's been pays tra- he's for a cameo from him, and he uses that time to say he wants to fuck no, you. No, off cameo. He's this talking on Twitter about wanting to fuck Kyle. Devin D E V O N selfies. Devin the selfie slut. He's going. He's, he's harassing me, and I might press charges. He like he legitimately. I respect. Don't with get me wrong. I think he's great. I like him as a as an influencer, as an internet personality. But he he's got to stop trying to fuck me. He legitimately like wants to fuck you. He's yes. I think you're more mad because you think you're so far out of his league that I, and yes, yeah, yeah, oh. yeah. Devin the selfie slut. <laughs> I mean, I love when a guy wants to fuck me. Like, go down. I think he tweeted at you not too long ago, Kyle. I'm oh, scared was, of what's on. Yeah, there. I don't even know what he could have. <laughs> if he wants to fuck Kyle, you know he's a sicko. 
Yeah, I wonder how he does on Cameo. <laughs> what is this? This Boy Scout leader just suck my dick in the bathroom airport. <laughs> <laughs> He's kidding. That poor guy. I sent KB No Swag a video because I really want to have sex with him. Somebody told me they played it on their podcast. They think I'm joking, but I really actually want to have sex with him. <laughs> just set the record straight now, I guess. If anyone, anyone knows, knows him, him, can you let him know I'm serious about the sex? Yeah, I've seen all your requests. No. Here we go. Not happening. Kyle with the new kicks, bro. Coral Stardust. I know. I saw him. I corduroy, yeah. I didn't like the corduroy, but I... I love the corduroy. I, I looked at that I like exact... colorway. colorway. I like the colorway. I was like, I, I don't know if I could. And then he comes in, and he does. Oh, you, uh, you thought about it? Yeah, I, I thought about pulling the trigger from Lapstone and Hammer in Philly. Great sure. streetwear spot, bro. Okay. If you're ever down yeah, in, the, in, the, in the 215, Lapstone and Hammer, bro, check those bros out. Mm -hmm. They got it going on, but they were selling those guys at cost. Yeah, I like them. You pay a, an arm and a leg for those oh, bad boys or what? Cheap, but they can get them for like 100 <laughs> Pretty good deal, Tommy. Don't talk about it, yeah. What are you wearing, Tommy? Don't talk about What's, my shoes. They're, they're, it's on torso. These are my hair. Those are the ones I asked you to yeah. throw away? Yeah, these are the white Air Forces I brought bought a few months ago. They're they're destroyed. I'm going to clean them tonight. It's actually. What I'm about on torso? On, torso. on torso. Oh, this is from Uniqlo. It's a hot dog and a... a kind of cool, no? Yeah. 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 It's a little gay. Oh, uh, well. <laughs> <Kidding>. <laughs> we got to talk. What is going on with this Titanic submarine? Oh, looking at the photos. I have never toes. felt worse for a group of people, but I go on Twitter, of course, and it's all thre clown. viral threads about why we should make fun of them. <laughs> yeah. What a disgusting app. Yeah, it's because they're rich. They're rich, so we shouldn't feel bad that they're going to... They're, they're gonna feeling die the worst tube. fear known to man for the next what seventy two. Oh, they're hours. definitely dead by now, I think. <sighs> uh, maybe a not. That th they said there were seven ways for this sub to surface, uh, but, but they can't even open. What it. is the deal? Why like, can't they find them? It's the ocean. How did the, they get the off power, track? The power went so. down. Like they can't be pinged. So when you, but they, didn't they know the general location they were going to? Two and a half mile area, I guess. Bro, that, just put out the put it out live. The we don't have the tech to find that. I, I saw, saw something. That there's only three subs that can get to those depths. So even oh, it's so far it, down. Coast Guard can't even get there. Or yeah. Something. Where is it? Does anyone know? I think off of Canada. Yeah. Oh, Newfies. Those are some of the nicest people in the world. Truly. But uh, can't they just give out the like geolocation of where it could be? Couldn't they just like make that po like uh, public and let like the world cr like crowdsource like looking for it in the ocean? Right. You would think there would be a way with that amount of time. But so if it's that deep, left. you can't crowdsource going that deep. Did you see what they control the ship with? Yeah, it's like a, a little PlayStation, PlayStation controller, controller. Uh, yeah. an, an off-brand one. So yeah, it's like a Logitech Xbox controller with long sticks. Well, what's uh, perplexing to me is that other people like James Cameron have gone to that depth and like uh, f not only gone there, but like brought another boat down there to like film them going down there. Like yeah. there's footage of other people successfully doing it from the outside. What went so wrong with these guys that they're billionaires? What corners were cut for these fucking billionaires to do this? That's I, mean, what I think I'm this. Saying, Ron. This company. What do you say? What do you say, TJ? Uh, very coincidental that a bunch of billionaires and one of their sons just happened to go missing in the ocean. I don't know. Seems too coincidental to me. Did Connected you see about the me. kid whose dad is on the ship? And he was like, but I know he would have wanted me to go to Blink-182. So he like tweeted a picture <laughs> of him at Blink-182. Wow. Oh, uh, yeah. it, it, so he, what he was wasn't it? sweating the like, small things. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually going to go. All right. That's a, <laughs> no, a good note to go on. No, I uh, I have to go to record with Pepe ever, uh, earlier than I expected today. If you guys figure this shit out, please let me know. Or if you yeah. keep on going, maybe I'll... Nah, the three of you won't possibly go for that long, would you? Just to say. No. Well, Valerie Act, you three? Mm -hmm. We get Tommy to talk about what he did in these cities. <laughs> I know. A detailed account. Lifetime. Lifetime of airtime. Tommy's <laughs> the male version of the idol. Yeah, you're just going. You're just like the biggest star in these cities. Just Spread get in your, your tiny little cock hole for you. <laughs> get in your box eating. You're getting your cock eaten in the back. Of the yeah, you don't get your dick sucked. It gets just eaten. Yeah, <laughs> <Cock> eaten. <laughs> slobbered hole. No, so my dick out. <laughs> They're eating like corn on the cob. You're spinning. <laughs> um, 
No, this the the submarine has been like giving me nightmares. I just found out about it this morning, so I haven't had time to have a nightmare about it yet. Look at the look at the photos of the interior of the submarine. Yeah, no, I saw that they're horrifying. Yeah. I don't know why you would ag- I mean again, not that you deserve to die, but I don't know why you would even agree to go into that just to see the fucking a shipwreck of the Titanic. A lot of like the, the parts movie. he bought for the sub were from like Camping World. Uh, see, that's something that I would pay to do. But but not for that risk. Apparently I didn't know the what waivers the risk you sign. haven't do they do those they tours? Bring a death a lot on the um, waivers. Yeah, then I wouldn't do that. But, but they right. call everybody on but, like, ship ex- uh, adventurers. They they're funding it's not call themselves scientists right that's the only window and it's right in front of the toilet oh yeah i didn't even where is the toilet it's right in front of that it, uh there's there's a twitter video that's fucking nuts Him is there is is there a captain or is it just the five no uh, the, that's a really good question uh, somebody has to be controlling it right who's controlling it with that xbox controller there's the xbox controller and then there's an elevator down button that just brings you down yeah. Yeah. I, it's like Oh yeah, so people are saying they're dead now. They're already dead. Well, is it they found I think it's official, right? I, I don't know. I think they have oxygen until Thursday. Unless they're panicked and breathing quickly. That's so scary. Yeah. Who would you want to be stuck in there with? <laughs> Probably like a, a religious figure. Someone who's tough. You think religious figures are tough? Like a f- like a twenty three year old young H- Hindu woman in Buddhist people are the toughest people in the world. Really? Yes. Mentally, do they not fear yes. death. No, they don't let their dopamine get too high. <laughs> They're the ones who centralize their dopamine. Are you going to try to be Buddhist? Yeah, Huberman jacked their whole swag. The Hindus cultural appropriated them. Yeah, but then have you seen the Huberman sub as of late? It's a nightmare. It's a disaster. It's, it's a disaster of parody you and satire. I hate everything about it. Sub. I'm on that sub to to discuss things academically, <laughs> and they have ruined it. <laughs> it's I, your uh, fault. Disgusting embellishments and hyperbole and satire. It's gross. It is. It's it's your fault. What? It's your fault. It's not my fault. This needs to end with you getting on his podcast. His gra- I ha- his greatest. I'm student. not even. Lo- I don't. I'm not looking up to him. He didn't invent these strategies. I have tips for you him. Subscribe to his newsletter. He's spending way too much time on social media. I have tips <laughs> for him. Mm-hmm. I tried some of your. Uh, I tried a little dopamine. I last Saturday I was in New York City, went out with my friends for for hours. Left my phone in my apartment, five hours, six hours. It was incredibly freeing. I really yeah. enjoyed it. I got back to a text from Rudy asking if I wanted to hang out. <laughs> and I was I like, he needed you at that moment. Yeah, I was like, sorry, I didn't have my phone for five hours. And he said, what a, what a stupid excuse. <laughs> I was like, it's the truth, man. I'm on the KB kick. Everyone's doing it. I was looking uh, right into the airport in an Uber trying to find somebody wearing purple shoes. Couldn't do it. Not hard. Nick, tell him. We saw the most purple shoes in the world. As at the soon Bronx as you, Zoo. as soon as they enter your mind, you'll see them everywhere. The Bronx Zoo. Yeah. Yes. It was at the D hole station. Yeah. You ever seen the D hole, the animal? Dick hole? No, it's just D H O L E. I think it's probably Dole, but I read it as D hole. They had no. rusty auburn D holes. They had brown D holes. It's a type of animal. Yeah. Nick, let's say our right. f- let's say our favorite part of the zoo on the count of three and yeah. see if we- all right three. Two, one, giraffes. Rass. What a species. Yep. Giraffes at the Bronx what Zoo hit extra a hard. Fascinating species. They should not exist. You ever watch giraffes fight? Oh, they're just smacking uh, their they necks. Smack their necks. Oh, Kyle, you guys. Oh, yeah. like I don't like them sleep. Much. They tangle up their neck like a cord. No, the giraffes fighting is exhilarating. The sound it makes is look at this. We got a fight? Are the Oh, oh my god. Oh. It's all neck. I mean, they're what ma- else can you do? They're majestic. I don't throw that word around lightly. They were just pacing back and forth. They look fake. They're huge. Babies are six feet. The baby comes out six feet. Ooh. I've never seen anybody throw neck like this. <laughs> Should have been in, in Key West. <laughs> <laughs> what is the scene in Key West? 
Um, so we flew into Key West. Uh, we were actually at the Hook Fishing Store. Shout out Hook. They sponsored the trip. As we were there buying uh, fishing merch for the trip, the Gay Pride Parade came right by us. Uh, I just can't escape. It, it finds me, gayness, uh, like, a, like a magnet. And so, yeah, you moved f- from the most gay street in New York to, to the new newly most gay street in New York. You yeah. think there's any sort of coincidence? No, <laughs> what everywhere is Tommy that? moves is the gayest yeah, street. I, mean, I don't want to say, but yeah, recently I was living, for the la- last couple of years, living on the most gay street in New York, and then I just moved, and I'm now still on the most I'm gay street. I'm pretty sure I'm in like the, the gay area historically. There is a, like an actual gay street. Yeah, yeah. Stone Wall Monument. Yeah. yeah, I couldn't. Li- I figured I couldn't live on Gay Street, actual Gay Street. Uh, but yeah, Key West is is. I don't know. We were in a, a couple of keys over on Marathon, which was kind of really nothing to do. That's wow. Key West. Yeah, but how how were you as an outdoorsman? I was better than they expected. You know, I think oh Tommy, he's a pussy. He's weak. He's nothing. He's frail. But I jumped in the water with the. With, yeah, his nose is big. Uh, but I jumped in the water with the uh, with the Goliath groupers, the nurse sharks, and uh, at first they were like, "Oh yeah, like it's fine, just jump in." And then an hour later, the the crewman. Well, was, why is it fine? Because the, the, those type of sharks don't bite, I guess, or they're not really that big, yeah. and they're like, "Oh yeah, sharks just won't approach humans there." But then an hour later, one of the crew people was like, "Oh yeah, I never like jump in. I just figure it's too yeah, dangerous." There's just no like, way you fuck? know you that should... definitively. Is that thing. Is it? I can't. T- is it upside down? It's a Goliath grouper. That's me. That's you. Yeah. That's you. a Goliath Huge. grouper, and yeah. and me. Shirt on. That's me, Sydney, and ha- uh, yeah. Well, listen. The guy also had a shirt on. Like the official guy that was swimming left his shirt. I didn't want to get a sunburn. That's a really artsy picture I took. Uh, that's me again. I have a hat on there. Is uh, that the a, shirt you wore in the water? And that's a palm tree. Yeah, that's the shirt I wore in the water. Or a hooded. You wore a hoodie into the water. <laughs> <laughs> it's to protect from the sun. That's me. Cat. The shark attacked the boat, and I caught it. Uh, I love how you didn't even think of turning the volume. <laughs> <laughs> well, I did. Like the I did. I did kid. think about it for a while, but I wanted the oh's from the boat, so I figured, you know what? They'll just think, oh, I misheard that. That's fair. And not that it's backwards. What is this? <laughs> oh, that's me reeling no in a Goliath group. No uh, that really was quite Who sore. What? You're thrusting. <laughs> I'm a blogger. Well, you wanted to. Like, <laughs> you My had to. <laughs> that's Hannah. I got him. That was oh, RJ. Man. He was uh, one of the crew Tommy, people. I, I got him. Oh. Tommy. Wow. Yeah. It's whatever. All right, bro. Same thing. Ready? Yeah, yeah. Grab that Grab that. Just walk it over. Yep. So that's what you want to do is you want to use the motion of the boat. You're in the water. You really want to use the motion of the boat. And just really ride that momentum. Is that fish upside down? It's dead. No, it's, no, it's, dead it's alive. already dead. It's alive. It's alive. You have to throw them back. You're not allowed to keep them because it's an endangered species. They knew what they were doing. They get the hook out of the mouth. They put it back. No fishes were harmed. Is it a like a violent fish or just big? Just big. I don't think it's violent. I don't think it would do anything to like a human. At least that's what I was told. Che, what was your biggest W recently? At Che, what was your last big dub? I don't know. I haven't. I was just in awe of the yeah. size of that fish. It was pretty sweet. Yeah, I feel like you're due though. That's exciting. What? That I'm due for a dub. Well, when's the last big W you've had? Uh, I don't know. Maybe in, uh, going back in a do. That, that was, was a couple nice. weeks ago. Yeah. Well, what about the last big L? Mm. I don't know. Did you have something in mind? No. You seem like a WL guy, like Tommy. It's, it's like a sick run, hot and cold. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. You guys never stack W's. <laughs> Well, I mean, uh, we I do stack yeah. some. But you have big W's. But yeah, I you have huge W's. Huge W's, don't get me wrong. But you don't stack W's. <laughs> okay. I have a stack of size 12 W's. Yeah. You have a uh, size 36 Nick's stack w. of W's, like the filing cabinet in Vermont. Right. <laughs> so there's a difference between stacking and just obtaining W's. Sure. Right. right. It just depends. Would you rather have a huge W, but with some L's, or just a bunch of little dubs? Yeah, that's fair. I've always Absolutely. been very cyclical. Yeah. 
I think I'd rather have a bunch of huge, like memorable W's than regular size yeah, W's. Yeah, it's a good debate. Let's let's try to relate it to Peaks sports. What would you rather have? Who's had the <laughs> most like cyclical roller coaster career as a as an athlete? Hmm. Hmm. Now that's a good question. Che, what quarterback? Grant, Grant Hill, maybe. With injuries. Yeah, but he was the best. Then he was a bust. Now I mean, he's good again. Then he stunk, and then he revived his career in Phoenix. Maybe Eli Manning. Not the best career. This guy's walking like he's way fatter than he is. <laughs> <laughs> he was walking like a tub of lard. He's not that fat. He's not even fat. He's not fat at all. He's, he's a walking good. like obese. <laughs> Jay, can you go snag him? Yeah. We gotta see. He's trying to steal Valor, yeah. He's stealing, yeah. yeah. He was walking quite yeah, well. Pull him in here. I think Eli Manning might be the answer. I think that's a good that's a good one. Because he the has two massive Ws. One of a casual w's. fan like me, I just think he had an incredible career. I think he I had mean, a pretty pedestrian. He'll be a Hall of Famer, yeah. but and I, as a Giant fan, I love him. I think he's underrated. But yeah, there were a lot of years they missed the playoffs. He would throw twenty five interceptions, but then he beat the eighteen and Patriots. He beat him again. He won two Super. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Yeah. Everything I see about Otani makes him seem like the best athlete of all time. Yeah, it's what it's, is the deal? Is he? He's, he might be. Like, oh, it's almost why does he not, not get enough. more credit? He is, he but should, it almost should be, be world talked famous? about all the time. He plays for the Angels. He's yeah. a pitcher and a hitter, and he's, and he's incredible great at, both. at both. Yeah, he's, why isn't he getting more shine? I mean, he's getting a lot of shine, but he's not even like an LA public figure. Yeah, I think I think the Angels well, he is he really cares about. Yeah, wow. I believe he's minus 500 to win MVP. Yeah, he has a legitimate chance to win the triple crown offensively. Like, most a- or highest average, most home runs, most RBIs. And then he's also just an incredible pitcher. Yeah. So is he the best athlete active right now in the I world? Think, I think he has to be, yeah. But it like, doesn't seem like it on the, in the chat rooms and the tabloids. Well, one is that it's baseball. And two is baseball that it's is so popular. It is. He also hasn't had any. He's never been in the playoffs, so I think so that he like Mike Trout was the best for a while. He's be, he's for sure better than Mike. He's Trout. better hitter and he pitches. Yeah. And uh. Well, you could. And Mike. This Trout, year, he's been a better hitter than Mike Trout. You can make the argument. Mike Trout was compared to like Babe Ruth. Yeah. A couple he, years ago. What level of pitcher is he? He's a great pitcher. Like, like all star pitcher. Yeah. So he's an all star pitcher and hitter. Yes. He's elite at both things. It, does he, do ERAs mean anything to you? I know what they mean. Like, do you know what a good ERA? Like, if I get like, yeah, I would say three and a half. Yeah, he's he's thrown up sub three ERAs. Yeah, we got to get him some more credit. <laughs> get on that. You're gonna put people on to Shohei Otani. I think I need to. Yeah. <laughs> My best put ons are people like Shohei Otana. I need you to. <laughs> <laughs> do we lose him? Yeah, I was. Where did that fat how, tub of lard? How, how could that fat fuck get that fake far? Fat not fat. Lard. He probably Fatty. sprinted away like a skinny man. <laughs> Stephen's asking which way he went. Do we want to? Can we pull the tape and watch it? He had to have been. He a, was trying something. I get what he's doing. It probably it's like wearing vertical stripes. It makes you look skinnier when you walk like a fat man, but actually aren't. He was walking like somebody that like ends up getting fused to their couch. <laughs> like yeah, the threads stick to their skin. <laughs> yeah, it, yeah, it intertwines. He was walking like Gilbert Grape's mom. <laughs> he must have went out to lunch. But go figure. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Uh, Tommy, I need you to run. Your feat that you accomplished yesterday to Kyle. Oh, yes. Um, so it's a lot of chatter that I threw the perfect game on the Ox yesterday. He said he threw a perfect game on the Ox. I saw the songs. They were the safest selection yeah. of he played uh, a uh, popular uh, song. Oh, oh, so <laughs> safe can't be perfect? You no, played right. songs with – every song was probably over 50 million. You're, you're, that's yeah, the perfect playlist guy, but don't flex it like it's some play – like if you were in some the curator – I'm not pre- – listen, 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 listen. People are like, oh, you need to play, fuck. No one wants to hear songs that nobody knows. The you vibe, made a now song. I agree with you. The vibe we I were I agree in, with yeah. you. This I think it, you could do that. But don't brag about the playlist. You could have played you best songs the of the car. last one. <laughs> Who was in the car? And listen, it's the order. I feel like people aren't talking about the order enough. The way they were, how, how, how did, did you, you transition? What was the order? This is the exact it was order. All st- strategic? 
Yes, it was let me away, the vibe. That, away that was strategic. Did you do this on the fly? Yes, on the fly. So I have an, but I, it wasn't strategic. I have a playlist called Ultimate, which has a bunch of crowd. Ple- I have I have good, I have really good, I have better, and then I have ultimate. What's the point of good then? What it's, situation it's, is good called? I, good is my most listened to, but <laughs> but <laughs> it has really, the most. I'm doing similar. But shit, then if yeah. you want to get it to better, you have to go to that. No, wait, wait, you had here. all I want for Christmas is you. Yeah, and then a million. Yeah, wait, wait, what? Yeah, what thing? is your riskiest song on this? None of these are. Uh, risky. So Power Trip almost lost the car. Power trip, but I mean, I, I'm not. I didn't take. I didn't need to take rest. I threw. I threw fucking hundred mile power fastballs all game, and nobody could touch it. That's. I didn't need to take a rest. Now listen, am I saying I have the most unique taste in music of all time? No. We we're on a three and a half, four hour car ride back in massive traffic from the Hamptons. People wanted to sing. They wanted to hear songs they loved, and that's what I fucking delivered. Fair. And you end with sexy, can I? I mean, come on. Come on, you, you save Cry Me a River and No Air for that late? Did you have re- Stop, stop it now. Did you have Replay by Ayaz? <laughs> yeah, I had Replay by Ayaz. All right, that changes things. What are we doing here? <laughs> and you were banana. Wait, wait. I had I Want It That Way to No Hands by Walk. All right. Wa- no Hands might have gotten the biggest reaction of the whole car ride. That's the type of shit I was pulling. I heard, no people, hands. I heard that there was one song that really people were just like ah. yeah pat was power trip i said by jay cole yeah. um you know i like the song i did think about removing it i had one, and here's the other thing i had ones queued up that i removed and i said uh, 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 uh. this one's gonna be a little bit too risky and i would remove it right before it was about to get up join us so that's the, just that's the, the waves by kanye and chris brown yeah i love that song First of all, I have my notifications silenced for Nick. So when he asked, oh, you're about to say he had your notifications for on for me. No, ju- I have it silenced for Nick. So when Nick asked me to be on the act, I missed it. So sorry, because I know all the listeners are really disappointed. They were. Uh, I just have to say, like, it must be such a slow day. Like this company. If we've been talking about Tommy's playlist, no, we just started talking. About we just started. It. We just started. Oh, okay, okay. Because like we guys talked about it. We talked about World of T-shirts. We're about to talk about Gable Stevenson too. Oh, tell me about him. Yeah, so he is using. We'll it. just wrap up. Perfect game. Woo. No, no, no. It. Vib said it was a no hitter. Yeah, I'm gonna say the ball was caught at the wall on Power Trip. That for 52 songs. That's the other thing. A no hitter or a Perfect Game is 27 outs. I had to get 52 outs. 52 for 52. Come on now. Come on, let's not play. Don't play with me. <laughs> I have a song on yeah, Spotify. I have a pl- my only playlist on Spotify <laughs> is called Orthodontist, and there are songs I th- remember hearing in the orthodontist's office. Oh, no, like you dro- told me. Drops of Jupiter. You told me you have, because I have one too, a cringe playlist, a list of the cringiest songs. Yeah, what I do. What does that mean? It is songs that are like. Like songs like uh, uh, I'm uh, Hey Soul Sister or. Uh, I like that song. What was that best friend song? <laughs> that came like that out? song? <laughs> I think of like Bed Bath and like Department Store. Bed Bath and Beyond. You're gonna hear drops. The worst That's song so is that song, song by yeah. Nikki You Your. What is that? How's I got my go? head in. I got my head in the sunshine. Wait, well, that I, song's. Catchy. I got my head out the sunroof. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. No, that's a new song. That's catchy. It? Yeah, but it's safe. Here, I'll pull out my cringe my cringe playlist. Oh, uh, Jar of Hearts is on it. Oh, I love Jar of Hearts. Who do you anything? Sarah Bareilles, all all bangers. No, Brave. I'll be the That's king of anything. Uh, it's called Cringe Five Thousand. Here we go. Cringe Five Thousand. Yeah, it's the name of my playlist. Jar of Hearts, Hey Soul Sister, I'm Yours, Bubbly, Raise Your Glass by Pink. Can I read you? Those aren't cringe. Those are good. No, can I read you the lyrics from Raise Your Glass by Pink? Sure. Oh, don't get dan- Let's get. Oh, it's good. It's good. So. Right, right, turn off the lights. We're going to lose our minds tonight. What's the dealio? That was 2011. I love when it's all too much. 5 a.m., turn the radio up. Where's the rock and roll? Party crasher, panty snatcher. Ugh. Call me up if you a gangsta. Oh, yeah, that's bad. I Don't think be fancy, just get dancy. There's no Why so serious? Oh, like the Joker. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah was that po- it was uh, post Dark Knight? Had to have been, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Did she write it? Uh, we'll look at who wrote it. Ed Sheeran. I'm just, kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Um, Alicia B. Moore. No, she didn't write it. I don't know her. Well, what's her real name? Pink's. <laughs> Is it Pink, Pink Johnson? Johnson? Her name's Pink Johnson. <laughs> yeah. I don't know her real name, but 
S- so you three Carol, people wrote it. Carol, you have like a you have a good singing voice. You can sing. What is the social etiquette? When can you break into song? Oh, this is actually very big. Not talked about enough. Um, Kyle and I went. I'm sorry to interrupt. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, we went to a cabin, and one of the people there was a very good singer. And right. they sang. They were looking for any excuse to sing. <laughs> yeah. We yeah. were playing like this truth or dare card game, and we caught them palming a card where you had to sing your favorite song <laughs> yeah it was and it was like th- super whack i would do that despite so being of so incredible that. voice it, it's tough for you guys you have to hide all the acoustic guitars when those people are around are you one of them no i'm not actually you kind of have to make it like half ironic so it seems like it's a comedic thing or do you just go full on belt your favorite song no you have to it's so weird to me to think that someone like what if I was like oh like they pulled the card and we're like yeah like you know what it's very yeah. it's very a theater kid I'm a theater kid but I it's but very like, theater kid. Do you always try to spring spontaneous karaoke like let's do karaoke. Today. Okay yeah, yeah yeah I do, do that. When, okay. But you I do that you I deserve to get stuff. Like let's go to hey what, what do you do you guys want to go to karaoke after this? I do love karaoke. Yeah. You're not a good singer. Well I'm not horrible. Will you give I'm us horrible. a taste? <laughs> No, I'm not, I'm not horrible. Tommy, you're dog hey, shit. Tommy, can you do Jar of so Hearts? Bad, I am not horrible. I mean, I know my horrible. fucking vocal range. I'm not going to sing Jar of Hearts. But like, but What's know, your vocal range? I know he wants Sinatra. to Sinatra. Like, <laughs> so- <laughs> can you please sing I, I Did It My Way? Oh. <laughs> well, if you insist. Come on. <laughs> All right, here we Put go. some music on. Right, here we go. <clears throat> I mean, I'm not, I'm not good when like people are around and stuff. What, so you're good alone? Very good. Says who? You guys, Some, guys, oh my guys, god! Summer cook, of 2015, around the house, I could not stop singing around the house. No, no music, no music. Come no, on. we ne- no. Don't you want? It makes you instrumental. Right, fine, fine, fine. All right. Okay. And uh, I missed the beginning. Okay, here we go. Fine. There's. Wait, can we go to the the part? Oh, come on. Just start with it. regrets. Start with where uh, where it goes. Where he says regrets. I've had a few. Why is uh, that your best? That's where. It, okay, okay. Yeah. Yeah. So this is his American Idol audition. Regrets. No, this is bad. Oh, <laughs> you gotta do it. I've had a few, but then again, too few to mention. <laughs> My friends, I'll say it clear. No, see, I'm not good on the fucking you microphone. Like <laughs> You're, not You're not oh, bad. You're not bad. Without an mention. <laughs> that's all you need to do. <laughs> I've lived a life that's full. I've traveled each. And every highway, but more, much more than this, I did it my way. I mean, not horrible. Not bad. It was way, it's, it's better bad. than I no, thought. Dude, not horrible. Yeah, thank you. And it's this pretty is, good. This is the exact tone I was with World of T-Shirts golfing yesterday. <laughs> hey, man, that was really good. Fly me to the moon. <laughs> Wait, now Tommy's going to be the guy who doesn't stop singing. Yeah. Again, that's, yeah, but that I know bad. that's my vocal. You're right, you're not horrible. Ceiling is I can, is I sing Frank Sinatra and people say, oh, that wasn't bad. That's the best compliment I'll ever get. The best thing about when you sing is that your eyes just kind of like glossed over and you just kept looking around. Yeah, well, it was was like warging in Game of of, in uh, Game of Thrones. It was pretty. It was really good, actually. I'm really good. I feel like you're being sarcastic. Okay, I I've been. Okay, it was good. You're not getting. I'd even take. You're not not getting any. uh, You wouldn't make it to the second stage of America. Would he go? So he's not going to Hollywood. No, no, but I wouldn't be laughed at. I think maybe I get two nos and a yes. I, I think you're a. You're a comeback no. next year. You're a comeback next year. Yeah. That was good. Come Randy Jackson year. would see your potential and say, hire a vocal coach, but it's, it would be a no from him, dog. Paul Abdul would be like, oh, sweetie, I'm sorry. There's no, no, she'd say yes. I think no, because yes. Simon would say no first, and then she wouldn't have to vote. It would have been a no. But right. She would have I could sorry, tell myself it was 2-0, yeah. yeah. Okay, cool. Cool. I, I think you're the level of singing that, w- if you were on, trying out for American Idol, would not be televised. Just like this is <laughs> yeah yeah you know? yeah definitely would not. I probably wouldn't even get to the like. Apparently, there's auditions before the auditions. Yeah, I've done them. I did not get in. You've you tried did it for American competition. I I tried uh, to audition for American Idol like in 2018 or 2019. I did not get in. What is your Hall of Fame singing moment? I won a hundred dollars at a karaoke uh, bar for singing "I Have Nothing" by Whitney Houston. What is your is oh. that your best song? I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be dead honest. You have to sing it now. Yeah. Is that? Yeah, you're gonna have. Okay, to okay. You gotta get the karaoke. You need an excuse. You gotta get the karaoke though. <clears throat> yeah. I feel like I've only ever 
heard you sing like funny for your stand up sets. I mean, I've never yeah, heard they, like they don't have a they don't, you guys don't have a good uh, it's, it's very different cuz like there there I'm listening I'm like is this funny? Whereas here you're listening oh, you is can't, this like, good? you can't ch- now I have the thing up. So you can't you can't see the difference in in voice. Well, I'm just saying when you're at a comedy show I'm less concerned of is this person right? You're thinking well, you're I'm looking more for the to, jokes. Yeah, or yeah, is it's this kind funny? of like a loophole to be perceived. Right. So when you listen to like Little Dicky rap, like you're like you're not like wow, that's good rapping. You're like listening. Well, Little Dicky is a good rapper. I like yeah. his voice too, very melodic. Mr. McAdams, the best song I've ever heard. Uh, Both of you really. Wow. Good. <laughs> that's good. That's good, Tommy. Keep it, go- keep it going. I can't. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you, you were very good. That was impressive. I like hearing people say it's like oddly satisfying. No, it's not oddly satisfying. People have loved that for <laughs> yeah, it's years. It's oddly satisfying. Fucking moron. <laughs> <laughs> You're so different that way, Tommy. <laughs> Most no, euphoric this sensation in the world. <laughs> so different that way. <laughs> <laughs> you weren't even joking. No, it's dead. Oh, it's <laughs> they should do things where people sing and everyone comes and, and <laughs> listens. <laughs> you know, so I feel that way about jokes. I have too. this weird thing where I love hearing <laughs> that. Yeah, that was. I mean, obviously, like, like, I that's not a song that's in my vocal range. Totally. I don't want to be judged for that. We can, yeah, that you can very, sing one in your vocal. That's very impressive. Yeah. All right. You, I just did my way. I'm not doing. I'm not running it. Like, back uh, like a male female pop song. Hmm. I, 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 well, I've overdone What is the Shania Twain one? Just Give Me a Reason by Pink or, uh, Johnson. The one with uh, Kid, Kid Rock and, and who is that? Cheryl Crow. Cheryl, oh, put your picture photograph. Yeah, picture. that's probably, that's not really my vocal range. Mm. High School Musical? High School Musical. Uh, Breaking Free was my elementary school graduation. Play it. What was it a graduation song? song? Yeah, we Kiss sl- the Girl. What? Kiss the Girl. No, Breaking Free. That's a good song. Yeah. Right? You don't need to do any more karaoke. No. Yeah. Yeah, no, seriously. Good stuff. I'm green with envy. Yeah, what are you, are you guys? You guys, you guys want to sing one? Can't sing. I can't sing. Kyle? Um, no. Yeah, but I can enough. sing. You sound just like Edwin McCain. I yes, mm-hmm. yes. Lifehouse too. Yeah, and a little bit of fastball. What was that? Did you guys have when? graduation songs? What was your graduation song? It was supposed to be graduation by Vitamin C, but we got punished because we bullied a girl. And so we had to graduate to in eighth grade. What was wrong with her? Uh, her name rhymed with something. Mm-hmm. Um, and so everybody called her that. Uh, mm. So we got in trouble. Our principal was a nun. So she made us go out to What's the. What's her name? Kitch? No, no, no. I don't even want to say it. Alors. Every time I bring somebody up from the past, it, it, they find yeah. it. Yeah. Was it Bunt? No. Uh, her first name and last name perfectly. Just made. say it. Nah. No, I actually don't. Yeah. She's a person. She's a person. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so we had to go out to the national anthem. That was what we graduated to. Hmm. 
sucked. Che, you got the itch? You want to sing? Uh, I could sing a song that I know. Yeah. Uh, Tommy's going to like this. Yeah, I might. I might get off to this, Che. <laughs> Oddly. Um. Hmm. Uh, wish you were here, Pink Floyd. It's a very long instrumental in this, though. Not very many words. I can seem okay in my car. I'm nowhere near uh, Caroline's. Stop it, guys. All right, go ahead. That's just one guy. Stop it, guy. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't say shit. <laughs> Would uh, either of you guys l- like a uh, high noon? <coughs> sure. Oh yeah, they're so delicious. Yeah, damn right. If your tequila lover is never satisfied with malt. Hard seltzer offerings. Strawberry. Gonna tequila, love. Strawberry. Gonna love new high noon tequila seltzer. Oh my god. <laughs> premium hard seltzer. That's all on film, tequila, bro. And real juice. Son. Oh, you really finished it. Hit your son. face. I hit my face. Oh my we might need a replay. Can Only we do 100 that? calories, gluten free, no added sugars. Jesus. High noon tequila seltzer is now Rico. available nationwide in four bright, crisp flavors: strawberry, lime, grapefruit, and passion fruit. Caroline, great catch. High Noon Tequila Seltzer is great in the outdoors, especially around the pool, lake, beach, golf, and tailgating. Look for them at Drizzly or at your local convenience store or liquor store, or visit HighNoonSpirits.com. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, man. I knew you were going to open Ramifications it, Ramifications of I your you own open other flaw. Are you kidding yeah, me? Yeah, you're just flub city. <laughs> <laughs> Find it near you. Damn, smokes. Oh, God, I was throwing a perfect game, too. Yeah, it's you the were. polar opposite of that country singer who caught the beer that was thrown at him with one hand. That was cool. Should I still try to open it, or what? Did you guys see that musical artist who got smacked with B. a phone? B.B. Rexa, yeah. Yeah, is that, a, is that a very popular B.B. Rexa is huge. Your what mom loves B.B. Rexa. Mom? Yes. They I mean, threw a phone on stage and hit it in their face. Did you hear what funny. the guy said about it? Yeah, he was they were like, funny. Well, Yeah, they said, why'd you do it? He said, I thought it'd be funny. To throw a phone. You yeah. see the video of the guy who it was, no. yeah, just yeah. like, just like, butt, butt sucker. It's, it had to do with a butt. Um, uh, it's it's terrible. What happened to her? Did she get hurt? Did she get really hurt? Yeah. She had a black eye, a big black Ooh. eye, and she had to get stitches uh, on her eyebrow. Yeah. Did that guy get reprimanded? So I saw a video of like a off, like a an officer, a security guard being like, "Who threw the phone? Who?" Th-? And this like total creep was like. <laughs> <laughs> and they pulled him. They pulled him. Like I, I and uh, KFC's Minuteman says that she's pressing charges. She should. Yeah, she definitely should. Oh, it's terrible. She should garnish his wages. Sue your <laughs> ass. <laughs> we heard it a few times. Yeah, that's yeah. He was steady with the sue attempts. Wow. Oh shit. Yeah, it's terrible. He's and peas to BB. Yeah. That's crazy. You guys ever thrown something on stage at a concert? No, I don't get why you would want to. No, that's so that's like insane. Especially your own phone. Yeah, like what you got to lo- you're going to lose your phone? Right. There's nothing else to throw? I tried crowd surfing at Blink-182. I crowd surfed at a Mayday parade concert. Not through it on blind. What? I crowd surfed at a Mayday parade concert. I crowd surfed at a Mayday pup parade concert. Is great. You know about pup? What? A Brox. Pup? Yeah. A patrol? UP. Who's that? I went to their concert up in Cleveland. Crowd surfed. I can't see you doing that. Mm-hmm. I'm a big mosh pit guy, too. Mm. Oh. Can't wear the spectacles. Did you see the guy dressed as... It was a guy crowd surf... Ah, oh fuck. Everybody's saying it's Sam, Sta- Sam Smith, but it's not. It was just a guy jumping off the stage and nobody caught him. Oh my God, Nightmares. Sam Smith. They were saying it's him, but it wasn't. It was dressed as like a snail or something. Mm. Oh well, I, w- I should have had more details for that. Uh, TJ, yeah. did you watch Quinn's live the entire time we were golfing yesterday? Of course. So there's no need to put the video out, huh? Yeah, he pretty much <laughs> uh, all the jokes are, are are out there and republished on other accounts already. So I know cause I got a text from uh, Tyler Miller who's like, "Nice Garfield joke." It was your joke, Kyle. Must have sounded like me. Um. Yeah, I didn't realize he was filming the whole thing. I didn't really want that. I don't know what the relationship is there. <laughs> That's a good ass shot. Not that. Me? No. What? No. I thought you wanted a good shot of me. 
That one he hammered. We let him drive the golf cart. He was whipping it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> he loves his angles. Oh. Where did you guys go? Uh, Skyway in New Jersey. You guys went to New... It's over there. Is that where... Uh, Quinn, is that? Quinn's name? Quinn? Uh, that's that's Josh. Josh? Yeah. World of che- T-shirt's name is Josh. Yeah. Okay, okay. Is that where Josh lives? No, he lives uh, in Long Island. Uh, Marty knows Quinn, and Marty, I guess, also had math with Josh in high school. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They used to take tests together. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, World man. of math. <laughs> we are replay. I was reading the ad when Tommy got tossed that high noon. Yeah, play that. Oh, yeah, it's good. Is that on camera? No, yeah, well, it's on camera. Doubt it. It was. Oh, Viva Lestu already tweeted it. And you're getting destroyed already, Tommy. Fuck! People want you fired. Right after I threw the perfect game. Well, I'm a made man now, so. You're a made man, you're t- perfectly fine. Tough luck. Fine. Go smokes. <laughs> <laughs> Did you do it on purpose? No. It hit you, both of your hands. It like no, fell down your body do like a plane. You went like this to catch it. I did a one-handed catch yesterday. <laughs> Crowd. Yeah, just bad angle. And you pr- well, the issue th- was the microphone. Yeah. I don't think so. I'm sure that's what it was. And the microphone was just badly in the way. Yeah, I'm sure. Right now, I'm probably going to get a headache from that, so. Oh my God, these poor people. My heart goes out for them. You still looking at submarine stuff? Nothing but jokes about them. Who? You p- people are joking because they paid so much. The people trapped in the submarine. Who's trapped in a submarine? There's this five-man submarine that went down to see the Titanic, and it's just gone. And it's like th- it's the size yes. of like a minivan. Lo- look, at uh, it's You're joking. It's Controlled by an Xbox. But everybody's before. making fun of them because they were billionaires that went to go see this. You're kidding. Two hundred fifty thousand dollars a ticket, and, uh, and they're just gone. Yeah. It no, is funny this is the a bit. Not a bit. That's no, real. It is funny the different things oh. on Twitter where some people decide it's like, oh, this is off limits universally. Can't joke about it. And other it's things where it's just like, let's get all the, all our jokes. And you watch the morality s- like spin in real time where yeah. one person will make a joke. It'll go viral. And then yep. everyone's like, oh, we now don't have to feel bad about these people who are suffering the worst fate known to man. Yeah. Imagine they come back, like they're able to be found, and they're like, oh, God, people must be, must be Everybody's pouring one out for us. They're yeah. devastated, <laughs> and they're like, funny, yeah. you motherfuckers were going viral off our yeah. ass? DJ, can you find that kid that, like, his dad's on the submarine, he's like, but he would want to go to Blink-182. You think it's, like, the real life of the menu, and, like, it was on purpose? Like, we got all these Ooh. billionaires in a submarine. Yeah, they look like just watch decent that. I people. It. But there's a poor, there's a 19-year-old kid on there. No. You know what is okay to make fun of? Barstool Nate not having an identity anymore. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, I was, uh, I, I didn't really read. Can you give me a quick spark notes on that? ID expired, lost passport, doesn't know where his birth certificate is, needs ID for a flight, has nothing. <laughs> he doesn't exist. So where is he? Uh, the eyes. Is. Here in New York? Yeah. So this kid tweeted, th- like, his dad's on the submarine, but then tweeted this. Oh, fuck. What does it say? It might be distasteful being here, but family would want me at, at Blink-182 show. It's my favorite band, and music helps me. Wait, what? Times. The son of one of the people trapped yeah. is at a Blink-182 concert? Like, right before he tweeted this. Oh, stepdad. Oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, never mind. Sorry for wasting your time. <laughs> and I think he had one more tweet. That is so to, like, crazy. Blink- he was like, at Blink-182, my dad's in a submarine. But I'm still at your show tonight. Yeah, upgrade my tickets. Wait, this was before they were man trapped. Overboard. What? This is no, before this is they, they were s- they were fucked or after they were fucked? After they were uh, fucked. Uh, how long have they been? The I guess it's fair game. How long game? have they been in the submarine? What the fuck, dude? Yeah, that was insane. What was wrong? You walk down these steps across the platform to the elevator, like a man much fatter than you are. Like the fattest man in the world. Oh shit! Well, Did you used to be fat? No. I mean, maybe like <laughs> freshman year of college, I like I probably let, like put on like twenty five pounds, but no, you look good. You're not fat, but you walk like a, a jolly obese man. I'm like really nervous right now because uh, TC is playing today uh, college baseball, and so, oh. so I'm oh. just so, so that's probably it. I'm okay. just like 
head spinning right now. But yeah. I didn't heed your warning. I was like, hey, man, you're the TCU guy. I'm going there for man on the street for the championship game. And you were like, nobody's going to be there. They're on Christmas break. Don't go. Yeah. I told you. And, you well, told me not and to go. Well, we also lost what, by like 50 points. I think more. Yeah. Are you from the Dallas area? No, no. But – so I played like football there. So oh, you did? Oh, sick. It was like a walk-on kicker. Yeah, so you played. Like, yeah, walk on kicker. Yeah, yeah. Where are you from? Um, so like San Francisco. Okay, cool. Um, yeah, like a um, yeah, just a tad bit north of there. He's like how was the your mayor ex- of TC. Who was? It? How was your experience? <laughs> what? What? Just, what? Just like at the school? As a, on the football team, how did you guys do when you were there? Uh, not great. Yeah. So I mean, our you still got, got the fun. perks of all the, the. Yeah, totally. And I mean. You know, my friends, like, they all took that, like, one extra year, Mm -hmm. um, which was last year. So All of uh, your friends? Played on the team last year, so that was fun. Absolutely got their shit pummeled. That was the one game that that happened, but... How did did you, uh, did you, how long until you text them? What, like, after the game? Yeah. And what you say? Uh, You say, zheesh. I honestly didn't even text them. Yeah, I don't think I would. No, no. It's still all love, boys. What you did in itself is such a feat that I'll never forget. And yeah, what no. What you I, did is the one of the greatest things to happen to me, not just you. Yeah. Is that I wouldn't Ka- want to hear it. Kamala speech? I don't know. <laughs> have you seen the speech where she goes into – do you guys know what I'm talking about? Oh. She goes into the locker room oh, of some team. That lost, right? Oh, lost. yeah, And yeah, she's yeah. like, what you guys did today was brave. Oh, yes, yeah. yes. What yes. team was that? I saw that. No, it was uh, March Remember. Madness. Um, oh, yeah. It was, uh, the it was like the HBCU, right? right? Oh, yeah, it was HBCU. Yeah. She was like, and you guys did out there. Brave. Yeah, yeah. No, the, and, and Not as brave by as being points. the yeah. first uh, woman of color in, as a vice president, but brave. Did you get hazed? Uh, not on the – well – on the team, they um, they like made us do some like stupid like video, but it was like funny, like not right. like bad, but 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 the frat hazing was was probably worse. Yeah, it's the worst thing you had to do. I honestly like so we got put on whatever like uh, whatever the term is like two weeks into it. So I never got to do stuff that was that bad, but just I mean drinking and stuff like that. Nothing where it was like had to do, like, no asshole stuff. No, yeah. no, no, nothing there. But yeah. I will, uh, you know, in the future, I'll think more about how I walk and, you know. No, oh, yeah. it doesn't help anything. <laughs> I think you're just stuck. You're, you've got a fat walk. And not even, like, chubby. What qualifies a fat walk? Was it just, like, you were, like, bouncing your I, 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 I heard, I heard like, like, a tuba game. in my head when you were walking. <laughs> Good elephant. <laughs> yeah. Wait, so right. Manoli's like got a, like walks this. on the tip of his toes. We talked about that. Right? I think he's sneaking everywhere. Yeah, he's, he is an excuse. Yeah, he's 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 sneaking yeah, he's around. Sneaking. Sneaking. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he is doing that. He is doing that. No, I hear a tuba when you walk, Manoli. I hear the last two keys of a xylophone when he walks. Yeah. <laughs> like a like a DD from Dexter's Laboratory. Yeah, it's exactly exactly. <laughs> That's how he like walks. That. That's a reference I, and I only I I think would get. And then when and Dexter walks, it's. Yeah, he's a short little guy. Yeah, can you do DD get out of my laboratory? No, no, I can't. I I'm not an impressions guy. Never can, will be. Can you? Yeah, obviously. Yeah, I mean. Yeah, you don't just <laughs> ask that. Yeah, Why did I? And such I an oddly that. specific yeah. I yeah. fell impression yeah, to ask about. If he were to do it, how would it sound? <laughs> hey, Nick, quick I question. <laughs> if Nick were to do it perfectly, how would it sound? <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Oh. You do you want to watch your? T- are they playing yes, now? Yeah, oh yeah, go right, watch them. Yeah, go watch them, man. Good luck to TCU. Yeah. Yep. That was so polite that he didn't ask to leave. Yeah. Hey, man. Yeah. <laughs> He's going to yeah, think about it too much. DJ, <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> oh, that's the funniest sound. It's a great sound. I used to play, Frank used to play that when Glennie would walk into Barstool Radio and it would make Dave, Dave crack up every, every single time. time. <laughs> What do you search for that that sound? Fat guy tuba song. <laughs> yep, <laughs> I'll do it. Uh, Can you play the the, the Manoli walking sound? I guess I. That's the last two keys of a xylophone. That's what I don't I'd know imagine. What that means. I feel like D D walking. 
Do you, did you guys not watch that show? Do the, yeah, uh, do, do whatever do you're talking do about. Whatever, what is, do whatever you're talking about. Do circling I, back. Do the, do the <laughs> DD <laughs> walking. Do whatever you're bringing us back to. Just land show. the fucking whoa, whoa, whoa. plane. I'll, okay, I'll, I'll land the plane, but I actually can't do it that well. I'll be honest. Okay. Because I think he has a Russian accent. Okay, it's it goes, German. Goes, it's German. It Maybe. goes something like this. Uh, d- d- get out of my laboratory! Yeah, that was it. Finally, yeah. 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 spot on. Yeah. 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 I see why you brought that up three different times. Yeah. <laughs> okay, listen. Always it's <laughs> the sound they're looking for. Always trying to shoehorn that into conversation. <laughs> must be yeah. exhausting. Yeah. Anybody have an acoustic guitar around? What kind of dog is Palming that? Is that a lab? <laughs> yeah. Huh. Can you do the a bark lab, of the lab? Huh? Palming the truth or dare card. I dare you to do that <laughs> accent for me. You know who else had a lab? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, uh, three ads today. I must have known Smokes was on. You know where you don't want to see Smokes? At a NASCAR event. He's a wreck. Yeah, I'll be there. Oh, fuck. I guess you should read the ad then. Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) Uh, Yeah, this Sunday, uh, the Ally Ally 400, the Nashville Super Speedway, June 25th, 7 p.m. Eastern, on NBC, the Parker McCollum pre-race concert will be going. We'll have guitars and fast cars under the lights in Music City. Uh, will and Taylor from Bussin' with the Boys will be honorary race officials for the race. And the the new uh, uh, you come hang uh, the new Barstool Bar in Nashville will be open to race fans all weekend. You can come hang with Barstool talent seven to nine p.m. on Friday, June twenty third, and Saturday six to nine p.m. June twenty fourth. 2023 is the 75th anniversary of NASCAR, uh, and coming up is NASCAR's first ever street race, the Chicago Street Race, on July 2nd at 5.30 p.m. Eastern. Once again, Nashville, this Sunday, 7 p.m. Eastern on NBC. Smokes will be there. there <laughs> yeah, that's been only walking by. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> <laughs> uh, people to walk by there needs to be oh yeah there they are together <laughs> here comes dawson and manoli <laughs> yeah that fu- that sound is funny as fuck. <laughs> that sound is funny as fuck yeah <laughs> tommy you were in the i didn't listen to it yet but you were in the big booty mix in what yeah. fast in what way it's uh it's a drop from when i went to uh their show they premiered big booty mix 22 in boston and i went there to do man on the street and it's a little drop from that video where i just say to this guy you wouldn't know it's me unless you know it's me it's you talking i say you say it's like the end of us uh, if you want to pull it up it's at uh 35 50 and big booty mix get, is any of the comments mentioning your drop or just more about the mix uh, i didn't know about any comments i got tweets about it that's how i saw it and it's just me yeah. saying where's gabe and the guy says i don't know you know it's you wouldn't know it's me unless it can you give us like a taste of it acoustically? I think Sass yeah, is in a drop of a song and Mook as well. Mook is Big Booty? No, not Big Booty. So give me the songs that it was mashed up. What were you in between? No, so it's right after Acapella what was it's right Acapella. after Enter Sandman, which is pretty sick because I like Enter Sandman, Mariano, Yankees, blah blah blah. Yeah. Can you do the drop? Exilite in oh. tonight. I never ever land. And then where's Gabe? I don't fucking know. Just me asking this kid where's Gabe. And he says, oh, oh, but no, it's to- the word Tommy smokes. Is the word Tommy smokes. That's what you would probably prefer. Yeah, I would have liked to I mean if no I one knows been, it. I, I had, I had outright. Yeah. Where's Gabe? I don't fucking know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah, I w- if I, I mean, I have literally asked them before. I was like, oh, maybe we use something, maybe from my Vape God interview, maybe a quote from. They there. pulled. Where's Gabe? They pulled. Where's Gabe? Uh, but hey, I'll still take Gabe, it. Gabe, one of no, the members of it. the. No, it was this guy's friend. He was walking around. Dude, you That's get what like they a chose to use. Of game. all the Tommy quotes. Do yeah. you get a credit on the mix? Like, are you a writer? Or? I think so. Um, but yeah, it's a good good, good mix. Are you uh, friends with Caroline with anyone who's made it in the music industry? Made it in the music industry? Someone who's popping off? Um, I don't know. It's one of those things where I don't even know people that I know. I, f- I, w- I follow a lot of, like, we That's mutual funny. mutual follow with a lot of people in the music industry. Mm, no would have done. I don't know if I know anyone who's, like, yeah, killing it. So you did, like, theater. Yeah. And, like, chorus. Yeah, I guess, I guess like, so. Yeah. I didn't do, I didn't, I, I, 
I I didn't go to school, so I didn't do any of that in high school. I only did it in college. So when did you realize you can sing? Um, I remember singing uh, Kelly Clarkson's "A Moment Like This" when she won American Idol, and being like, "Damn, I sound good." Yeah, just like you had to figure it out yourself. Mm, but I didn't sing in front of my family until I was like a junior in high school. Wow. How scared. long were you homeschooled for? Uh, until uh, I graduated high school. I graduated high school homeschooled. So and you went to what? What college did you go to? I went to Oklahoma City. It's like a uh, as like an artsy small uh, like liberal arts college. Okay. But so you've never really been bullied before. Uh, just by my uh, parents. Your and parents, siblings. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, parents. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. No, yeah. you know. That's a weird, weird. Uh, or the kids, not, not kids, you, in the kids in my youth group. Okay, you kids were in my youth group. Okay, kids on my cr- kids on my uh, homeschool Christian basketball team. How were you guys? Were you good? Yeah, instead of MVP, we got Christian Character Awards, <laughs> and I got it my uh, my sophomore year. So. Of the CCA? Yeah, the CCA, I got it my sophomore year, yeah. Shit, congrats. But do the Christians like that, do they not fuck with Catholics, or what? what's the deal? Well, here's the deal. On KFC, stereotype. on KFC, I said my experience, and this guy was like, fuck you, like all these things. But We don't fuck with you guys too heavy. You, no, exactly. Catholic, yeah. We don't we're fuck with the, you guys. We're by the book, yeah. Someone you guys so- bend a lot of the rules. Catholic gang? S- Mm-hmm. See, yeah, no, no, no. We don't, w- but I, I think that there's a lot of people who would say that we do. And like, here's the deal: religion is, it's so personal. It's like a, it's like your coffee. You it's know? divisive, and we know we don't really fuck what you're doing with the movement. Exactly, and that's how we felt about you guys too. What did you not like about us? We were like, oh, God's not enough. You guys have to have all these rules. Yep, yeah, we do. But yeah, you guys have show. less rules. Christians have less yeah. rules because because God died for our sins. You guys got you adding all this what ty- stuff. What type of Christian are you? I guess you Southern Baptist. That's a oh, that sounds that's like a pretty heavy duty. It's that's pretty a, heavy duty. A, they love God. Yeah. Oh yeah, they do. Yeah, they do. Mm. And when did you realize, like, oh, this is pretty heavy? Like, this is this isn't a regular upbringing. You no, know, maybe like uh, fourteen months ago. <laughs> 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 oh fuck! <laughs> you guys never won CCA your sophomore year. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, Nobody CCA's else here normal. has a Christian character award? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. No, no, no. I, I realized things were weird. Like, uh, you know, uh, w- we had, like, homeschool prom, too, and, like, it was it was weird. What? Wait a minute. You would do with other home local homeschool Yeah, kids? but you didn't know. How do you ask them, or wh- how did you get asked? Well, here's the deal is, like, you didn't really – so, like, okay, f- so, for example – I I'm from the Dallas Fort Worth area. There's a lot of a lot of us there, right? Yeah. And so, all the kids from the Dallas Fort Worth area go to prom together. But you like you probably only know of 20 other homeschool kids. Like you don't know all these kids. So you go and you're like, this is we don't know each other. You know what I mean? So uh, did you have a date or did you? I had a date. Oh, okay. Um. Did you know him? Well, it's my brother. You just can't ask. Can't ask. Can't ask. Can't ask. Oh, that's right. <laughs> LOL. <laughs> um. Uh. No. 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 I had a date, and it was like a boy on uh the Christian homeschool basketball team that my brother was on, of course. And um. But the thing about it is, the chaperones who were our parents stood like on top of these podiums and looked down at us like while they were dancing. And then we had a swing dancing competition. <laughs> During prom. Oh, wow. And then we also played G6, but only the beat, like no lyrics. <laughs> <laughs> Karaoke version. And there was like there was like activities, like there was chess. You could play chess. Oh, my God. Wow. Was there prom king and queen? No, of course. G- Jesus is Jesus our king. Jesus king. Yeah. yeah. And not the Virgin Mary. Those are those cats. Nothing. Nothing in that area is bigger than high school football. Nothing. You got Allen. Except for homeschool Christian. You got Duncanville. You got Parish Episcopal. You got yeah. some of the best teams. Allen's in big. And then they had, they, they had they had that. They hire coaches like college coaches. But you know about the Allen uh, field, and then it like caved in. No. Well, okay, I don't know the exact thing if you're from Allen, uh, but Allen football, which is a massive football team in Texas, bought this insanely expensive field. And then, like, a year or two in, they found out there were, like, issues, like, underground issues, and, like, it wasn't usable. But they they yeah, dropped insane crazy. money on it. It's fucking oh. nuts. That's the story, yeah. That's it. Jeez. What Jesus, did literally. Did anyone here um, do that, like, uh, Dexter's lab in person? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, I don't know. Nick, can, can you get do out it? of my laboratory? Do it, but do it. Do yeah. him singing Dun- uh, Gavin DeGraw. I don't want to be, or yeah. what? Yeah. Chariot. Chariot. How's Chariot go? How's Chariot go? 
I only know I don't want to be. I don't know. Gavin DeGraw should have been bigger. He was big. Based on what I know, yeah. <laughs> well, that works. What's like your favorite that. Gavin DeGraw song? I like Chariot, even though I don't know how it goes. That's the only one I know is I don't want to be. Uh, Maybelline. Oh, he has other ones. Maybelline. Hey. In an old mother tree. Yeah. And I say to myself, for your last touch. My favorite food is. I'm looking up Gavin DeGraw. Jack Johnson gets so big. Chip. What who was listening to? What were you doing when you were listening to Jack Johnson? You're like you know cooking, you're you're cuddling. Yeah. I'm starting to get into country music a little bit. I'm dipping my toe. Oh, not over you. That's a that was a big one. How's that That's go? good. I'm not over you. Mm-hmm. Huh. Shall we uh, sporkle then call it? Do a call. We can do a couple sporkles. Couple sporkles. Yeah. yeah, a couple sporkles for the boys. You guys watch Smosh growing up? Caroline. Yeah, I uh, love religiously. Battles, they were the first thing I ever watched. Yeah. They just bought it. The, they bought the channel back, just announced. Whoa. Wait, what, what was it? Oh, Fill me in. It was them. like an OG It was like the, fir- the most subscribed to YouTube channel for like the first pull five Pull them back up. W- the food battles I love. The Pink Donut, I think, was they my favorite They lost their channel? Battle. They sold oh, it to a multimedia conglomerate group that was going to like help them with money, and then that group dissolved and basically left them out to dry. That's They're they both did. back together. Yes. They bought it together. I'm watching the video right now. That's really exciting. Super exciting. I had a Boxman t-shirt in like 2007. Dude, I, don't know if I can even say his name. Uh, uh, Ryan Higa? Higa, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wait, yeah. yeah, yeah. I loved how to be him. a ninja. He was a high school to be wrestler gangsta. too, yeah. Yeah, yes. yeah. those were some of the greatest videos of all time. It was Yeah, yeah it was him, Smosh, and Fred. Oh, Fred and was PewDiePie. big. They were the, uh, but the, I don't even remember PewDiePie back then. Looked up Fred recently. Out. Old H3H3 was awesome, too. Yeah. Ray William yeah, Johnson. He was, yeah, he was good. I forgot about those. That, that's yeah, the first viral. H3H3? YouTube. You guys ever see the Mario? It was like a it was a viral one about Mario goes to the hood or something. Right. There was a Remy. Remember Remy Gillard, the French prankster. Yes, he was legendary. He was legendary. I wonder he was, what he's up to. He was a. He, I bet. And I, I would hate to know that his videos don't hold up because I'm pretty sure they would. <laughs> In I, my head, they're holding. He up. was amazing. Was he the guy that had the big pigeon suit on and was shitting on? He would do a lot of that, of and he would go to jail often. Yeah, for the sake of the game. I don't even know if this was when YouTube was monetized. That's someone who loves their craft. Mm-hmm. I know your ass fucked with that Bassmaster. Loved it. Yeah. <laughs> he was. Oh, ass that's an easy call. What? <laughs> Did you just ask? I said I know Ed his Bassmaster. He was the. He, he was a Ed great Bassmaster. Okay. I said it like in a cool way. Okay. Well, Who was the Jack Vale? I don't know him. I think that you guys a big prank pe- prank video. Yes. People. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Who else was there? Can we pull up him. P- p- the p- he was a giant pigeon, right? Pull up Remy Gillard's highlights. Come on. H- him in a versus battle against anybody. He's the best. Yeah. Fuck it, Remy Gillard highlights. You've been seeing those TikTok trends. I won't. It's like How are you? How's TikTok going for you? Uh, it was stagnant for a while, and then this past week, I was like, I'm just going to post a little bit more, and it's been better. So I guess yeah, that's what how works. it works. What? I don't know. You could, like, last, last night I posted a video of... Uh, of being like last song for the Ox for a perfect game and it, it's got a lot of views. I don't know. People are. Oh yeah, this guy just washed his car. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, these are still gonna hold up. They have to. This might be fake. Fuck. Yeah, because how did he get him to <laughs> sign the waiver that. to use this? This is before that. Or waivers. Oh really? <laughs> oh. That's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> now this is fake. You think it's fake? Yes, this is fake. Yeah, it probably is. It's still funny though. It's t- <laughs> God damn it. Yeah, that was good. Alright. Sporkle. Sparkle. It's sparkle. So it's a quiz we do. It's school. Okay. I school. Take uh, except yes. without your parents. Okay. It's a weird concept. It so uh, our categories are: we'll start with Kyle. If you get it wrong, if you get one wrong, you're out. Oh, I'm gonna be out. No, you won't. Uh, the categories are: three terms for strokes under par in golf, 
three Pokemon types added after Generation 1. Four original players. Kyle, can you read it? I'm the first. Four original players suspended after Malice at the Palace. Four original flavors for Sour Patch Kids. Four colors for the game. Sorry. Five Spice Girls. Five animals with strongest bite force. Mm. Seven Wonders of the World plus honorary member. Nine states with no income tax. Nine movies featuring Matt Damon and Ben Affleck. So if I get one of them wrong, you're out for the whole thing. Can't miss one. Yeah, but they won't last this long. Uh, but you only have you don't have to answer nine answers. You just have to say one of the nine. Oh, so I can go out of order. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm in. I'm in. Yeah. So who's first? Kyle Bauer. Start with me, and we're already at, okay. Was it Snake? No. Huh. Circle. Circle. Three terms for strokes under par in golf. Birdie. Eagle. Tommy, wait. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Tommy's turn. So I got it right. Eagle. You don't have to go in order, though. You could jump Good. around. Oh, I know. Uh, so I'm going to do five Spice Girls Posh Spice. Or Posh. I'll go Baby Spice. I'm going to go Albatross. Albatross Spice. <laughs> There's the star of the World of T-Shirts video, Coleman. I'm going to go with Goodwill Hunting. That's for a movie with Matt Damon. I'm going to go with Scary Spice. <laughs> I'll go with Ginger Spice. No. Why are you doing this? A real dickhead. It's so also I, one of the only ones I'm I not going to say this. I thought there was multiple Mel's in the Spice Girls. I will not, will not fall down this hole. I think... Original players... I think that was Ron Artest. Come on. Yes. I'm going to go with... Florida for a state with no income tax. Uh, is Puerto Rico a state? Is it considered a part? Yes. Yeah, Puerto Rico. Psych, it's not. Oh, wait, oh, really? No! No! <laughs> no! Unbelievable. That's what you get for states, asking. That's what you get for asking. these states, you should know them. Well, I didn't know. Yeah, I know Puerto Rico for, doesn't have... Scold her, scold her. I know Puerto Rico doesn't have a... Uh, I'm, I'm out then. Right? I'll go Sporty Spice. Oh, there's another spice. Damn it. I should have gone with Sporty. Fuck, I don't know any of you them. You want to use your re-entry pass? Oh, there's one? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'll go back in. I'm back. back in. Four colors, four original flavors for South. I don't know that. Oh, yeah. Blue raspberry. Oh, there's... It, but it was blue raspberry. And I knew that would happen. You're, um, I'll take Texas. What are these states? Oh. I'll go green for the four colors and sorry. Um, I'll go steel as a type added after generation one. F four original flavors for Sour Patch Kids. Lemon. Uh, I'll go with red must be a color and sorry. Yellow is a color and sorry. I'll go cherry as a Sour Patch Kid. Whoa, no! Not one. I guess it's oh, not one. States with no tax is that um, Delaware? Oh, that's something else. Fuck. All right. Me. Tommy and Caroline are left. I kind of. Uh, wait. So the nine movies they they must have both Matt Damon and uh, Ben. Tommy, Affleck? technically, if you get this, you win, because there is no reentry pass. Oh. Oh. All right. I kind of feel like. What do I feel like New Hampshire has no income? Tax. I'm gonna go with New Hampshire. What happens if no one wins? This has never happened before. Oh my God, oh. he won! Good win. Any more you want to add on? No, maybe Vermont. Those shit. Let's try know. for the the animals with the strong. Would that be like a crocodile? Hippo? Like yeah, it is a shark. It's a sarocodile. Oh, that's sick. Uh, I guess <laughs> <a snake? laughs> that's sick. That's like a millionaire. You think a snake has the strongest bite for? A uh, shark. The shark. One of them. It's a hippo. Snake? Gotta be hippo. Oh, uh, great white shark. What about a grizzly bear? What about like a lion? Oh. What about like a, a stag beetle? And I was embarrassed to try to touch this, but wonders of the world. What am? That's like Niagara. Is that like Niagara, Niagara Falls? Falls? The natural wonders and the, the, the pyramids. Uh, the, the pyramids. Before in the trust tree, I've always been confused about the natural. Right. It's like the, the gardens of, the of Babylon. Now there is. Oh, okay, so it's. 
an honorary member, and then it says 2001 wow. list. It was like Niagara Falls. <laughs> yeah. It's the man-made list. There's a bunch of different wonders lists. Yeah. So this is a man-made list? Babylon. I think so. uh, Great Wall of China. Yeah. I don't know if Great Wall of China is. Stonehenge? Oh, I'm wrong. Anchor Wat. Uh, I don't know. What about like the Library of Alexandria? Isn't that one or like the the Colossus of the Colossus of Rhodes? Is that how you say? One in Mexico. They use the T. Let's uh show. Let's let's reveal yeah. it. There was a recent movie with Matt. But yeah, what are, air? Affleck. What else? Uh, a Field of Dreams. Ian Silent Alligator, Bob. Jaguar. Yeah, those aren't popular. Too popular movies. Pichinitza. Christ the Redeemer. That's a wonder. Uh, Il Col is that Il yeah, that's Colosio? I guess is the. Oh yeah, yeah. Sorry, I forget what language I was reading. Maybe. We could do one more. One more. More. We'll call it. I appreciate everybody making these. Really cool. All right. Coming, thank you. Uh, a round uh, of sport. I was about to say, what types are these? Yeah, these, these are, are awesome. They're called grab bags. Landlocked U.S. state. Oh, well, I don't know. N like, I don't know Triple any of this. Landlocked U.S. state. Founders of Rome, Scandinavian countries, pro sports Hall of Fame locations, NFL bird mascot names, last six NCAA baseball champs, no, I like popular this one. apple varieties, Hawaiian Islands, Game of Thrones, Great Houses of Westeros, and bonus scientific names for yaks. Okay. Wow. Let's do All it. Right. KB. Uh, Tommy, Tommy won, so Tommy starts. Uh, let's go Cooperstown. Let's go Cooperstown. Uh, one word. One word. That isn't right. Yes, it is. Oh, you got you got you can't be doing these. Nah. Hmm. 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 You already you fucked up already. Me? Oh, we did? No, the person who made this. Yeah. Oh. What did, what'd you have to do? To put NY? I don't like that. Okay, Granny Smith for mm. apples. I will go Stark for one of the great houses. Okay, Scandinavian Norway. I'll take Sweden. I'm going to Honeycrisp. This girl knows her apples. <laughs> her apples. Um, I, I don't know. Denmark? I mean, it should be, but it looks like they're... Wow. Is it fucking Finland? <laughs> Fuck them, I guess. Is it? That's what it is? What? Fuck Finland? Fuck Finland. Oh, 2023. Um, K Canton OH. Uh, Eagles. You're gonna have to put Eagles, the eagle. Yeah, the eagles. <laughs> this, this. What's the mascot's name is it? Eagles, the eagles. His name's. Uh, oh. Eagles, the eagles. No, that's not my guess. That's not my guess. That's not my guess. I'm making okay, fun of Tommy. Are they, they want the name of the mascot. Name of the mascot. There's no way they want the name. Nobody of the knows. Mascot. That. No, that's what I think they want. That's what, when you said eagle. I said the eagle. Maybe you no. try Philadelphia Eagles, which is a lot. Oh, he he might out. he probably has the name. You're out. How wild See ya. Are out. Be, See ya. Give me Honolulu. Dog. That's I'm out because this what guy are you sucks. Seeing that made you say that. Hawaii city. Islands is that wrong? It's a city. It's the city. Oh my god! Oh. I give. I, I'm oh. bad. I'm out. I'm out. I'll go Oahu. O a h u. Um, Springfield, M a. I'll go Romulus, R-O-M-U-L-U-S. Is he not? Uh, Red Delicious. <laughs> Red Delicious. <laughs> <laughs> um, actually, o I O U S. <laughs> uh, I'll go Ole Miss. This is where it gets tough. Um, oh, Hawaiian Islands, 
Maui. Sword puzzles. Oh, fuck. He typed Hawaii. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Type Maui? Yeah. yeah. I'll go um, Mississippi State. Gala. Remus. R E M U S. I legit shouldn't be out right now. That's what bullshit. Hawaii. Uh, Kauai. K A W A I I. Or U. Shit. Is. Lannister. L A N N I S T. Uh, these these are just last names? Yeah. Tyrion Lannister. I never seen that movie. Baseball. Uh, LSU had to win. Damn it. Baratheon. That's game. Nice. Unless they won. Where's the Hockey Hall of Fame? Don't know. Toronto? Toronto. Vanderbilt's got to be a baseball school. Oh, yeah. Reveal this. I'm curious. How's Tyrell? These are, these are fun. Why are you guys doing this all the time? Macintosh. What is Big tri- Red. Oh, geez, they wanted huge the huge actual huge names package. of the mascot. Oh, that's ridiculous. Swoop Seagull's mascot. Mm. Swoop? What the? Uh, uh, somebody explain the triple landlocked U.S. state one to me. Ev- by the states of borders are all landlocked, and the states those border are all landlocked. They'll border a great lake or an ocean. Oh, Great Lake doesn't. I think so. Mm. I don't like that. Or maybe not. Nebraska. Yeah. Cool. All right. All right. Caroline signs off. Oh, shit. Fuck. No, it's fine. It's a new wheel. Go ahead. Carbone? Yeah, I want to go to Carbone. Oh, Oh, yeah. Ocean. Nope. We're just staying dry. All right. Thanks for hopping on. Yeah, guys. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thanks for having us. The Barstool Yak. Yeah. Bye, everybody. Peace. Uh, happy birthday to Dusty Balls. Bye.